What's up guys, my name is Jay, and today I wanna to talk to you about a commandment that I know firsthand can be a struggle sometimes, but I promise it'll make your life better. Let me read it to you out of Ephesians chapter six, verse two through three, and it says, honor your father and mother, which is the first commandment with a promise so that it may go well with you and that you may enjoy long life on earth. And I don't know about you, but I want to enjoy long life. And I hope you do too. But this was originally the fifth commandment of God's original commandments. And it was a promise to the Israelites. But Paul repeats it here. So it must be pretty important to us as well. So honoring your parents is simply just loving and respecting them. And it's not just doing what they ask you to do. No, no, no. It's about doing it with a good attitude and not making excuses. And the awesome part, when we honor our parents, we make them feel loved and respected. The promise is simple. If you and I both obey our parents and love our parents and honor our parents, we're more likely to live a longer life and a better life than those who don't. And I don't know about you, but I think that is awesome. <laughs> now you see, Sometimes my friend January doesn't follow this commandment too well. Watch this. Hey, you're not supposed to be skateboarding in the house. And I know for a fact her parents have told her once, twice, probably a million times. What are you doing? Not what to are you skateboard doing? in the what house. What are you doing? James. Not to throw the ball in the house. Yes. Not to bounce the ball in the house. And as you can see, sometimes she still struggles and does it. Wait, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, look. And she'll keep yeah. doing it until something bad happens. And then once that bad thing happens, she decides that, you know, maybe I should have listened to my parents the first time. And remember, we don't do anything for what we can get out of it. We do everything because Jesus wants us to. And that's why we honor our parents, because Jesus wants us to.